Eldred. Tough bucket. 12 points for him now. They take advantage of it. Yeah, that was Andrew Carr with the assist. Just walling up Clintman with a block shot. Hildreth with the Euro step. Hayes from England, why not? Cameron Hildreth getting out in transition. The Euro to the opposite side. That's a move you work on in your skill sessions, Dougie Fresh. That He's got 12 first half points. But at the other end, Marsh throws down the alley-oop. Nice. Matthew Marsh gets his first points of the year. We got a one-point game. Getting it done on the defensive end, swiped away by Monsanto. So an instant impact after getting inserted to the starting lineup for the first time this season. Hildreth on the blow by. Hildreth right to the rack. Count it, plus the foul. The line to try and complete the three-point play when we come back. Hildreth doing it all for the Demon Deacons right now. Do not want to give Hampton uh, paint touches off the bounce or catch. There's a steal. Well done by Hildreth. Your man under the spotlight, and he lays it in. Again, uh, he's doing a lot, and without Davian Williamson, uh, certainly they're going to need his all-around production in this game. Appleby can certainly shoot the three at 46% of the season. Look at the mental mistakes early by Way Forest and then the bad pass. Hildreth challenging Hall, spun it off the glass. They've missed all three of their three point chances. The thing is, they're not getting great looks. Hildreth wow. fouled, that's a three. We'll be going to the line for a chance at the four-point play. Tied at 39, he can give the Deeks the lead. The young man from Sweden at 6'10". He wears 34 in the gold, and also for the first time tonight, we get a look at Davion Bradford. And there's a three from Davion Williamson. And Absom is in the top 15 in blocked shots in the country, and that led to an easy basket. Marsh! Marsh giving us a pretty good opening 20 minutes here, Dan. Well, Hildreth, we talked about his ability to get inside, and he just makes a nice little dump-off pass. You need to be tough with the basketball, but you don't want to lose your aggressiveness. We're trying to thread that needle here. Hildreth on the oh. step throw, Bennett! I, I was never a huge fan of noon games. G-Man notorious. A little slow. <laughs> a little slow start. Warming up the engine. Here's a steal and a break. They've got the numerical advantage, and that'll be two on the break. Good decision by Hildreth to give it up. They get the ball right back with Hildreth. Carr fouled, going to the line. Here's the look, and, and one of the things, that, the key on this, look at Basile, had to lay off. He's got two fouls. He only played seven minutes in that first half. I think that was the key of how that play unfolded, and that's a nice wraparound and good catch. For the Tar Heels. Hildreth to Marsh. Marsh with the finish on the inside. Nice find. He saw the turnovers compared to the points for Louisville. And now another turnover. Withers gave it away. Hildreth in transition scores. And Worthing's own is going to the line for a chance at three. But these two guys made a, ma a, a major jump. You know, I think it's one of the reasons you lose an Alondis Williams and you lose a Jake LaRavia. Appleby once again trying to attack, getting Hildreth who touches the paint, takes it himself, and is able to finish. Just clearing out. So Hildreth just gets down to a strong hand. He gets the angle and just finishes. Coach Forbes not happy with that. He knows this, this group cannot give up. Fast break, uncontested layup. Damn Hildreth once again attacking the bucket, the reach in. Hildreth. Strong drive to the cup with the left hand. Great drive. He he averaged four and three last year. We wish Tony Anderson the best as he collided with the scorer's table moments ago. And Hildreth, the wow. fadeaway three. <laughs> that was outstanding. Wow. Hildreth working the baseline. A lot of dribbling here. him that last time he was healed with you know, a lot of guys down there when they see a bigger guy he's like you know what clear out i got a mouse on me let me go ahead a little up and over and then like i say finish it around the rim hildreth 
Gets a running start. Bounce pass. Carr. He is a tough, physical, down low play. But the way he plays, you got to have teammates who like you. Because, again, he'll take some shots sometimes with that freedom that make you scratch your head. He'll drift. Turbines to the rim. Hildreth, strong drive, Ooh. left hand. This is Hildreth's game. Watch him back down. You, you think about watching his own overplay. Great pass. To Zach Keller, the freshman Ooh, getting some Zach run Keller. here in the first half. Early in the season, he's playing some. Very good defender. You got Appleby on the left-hand side. You see the floor. All right. If it is shot, he's got to come back and help the rebound. Good job of creating the turnover. Clancy-like pick from Hildreth, who pushes and finds Carr. If you look at the right side of your screen, watch when this ball reverses. Watch Hildreth on the right-hand side. He's going to read the passer's eyes. Good steal. But I got Smith's into double figures with 11. This is a tough matchup for Smith against Hildreth as he backs him in. Beautiful feed to Matthew Mark. Problems for NC State a little bit defensively. Wake is not doing that because that's not part of what they how they play. Hildreth reverse layup is good. And Hildreth. Monty Monsanto on him inside. Demari Monsanto is a shooter that is fearless as Cam Hildreth left his man in the dust and got the easy layup. Final 11 seconds. Hildreth's going to try to make it a little closer. Kletchman lays it in. And couldn't chase it down. And look for Notre Dame to post their guards. Go in and uh, Starling. And a great take there. Made a huge jump this year. Big improvement. 13 points a game. The crossover. Last two games. Three points total for him. One of ten shooting. Works was double. Dropped it low to Zona. And it's knocked away. Hildreth Here's recovered. Hildreth with the block from behind. Davis tries, and he is short. Black, another offensive rebound for Carolina, and Hildreth swipes it. And Cam Hildreth lays it in. He's got three fouls. And watch this steal by Cameron Hildreth. Does a great job getting the deflection. So that means Davian Williamson returns to the starting lineup for Steve Forbes. And Hildreth off the turnover, pushes in transition for Wake. He just adds to his total right here, getting his hands up, getting the deflection, and coming away with it. Taking things in his own hand with the and one there on Sturdivant. Getting in some foul trouble. Our game one of seven of the ACC today inside. Clipman and Hildreth found them. They got some, oh, Mearson with good rest minutes early as well. And the Long's only got two points so far, and that's Hildreth backing on down against Nigel Pack. He's been special, Tom, and a lot of it has to do with the fact that he struggled the two games prior to that as Cam Hilton gets downhill and is able to finish off the glass, winning his matchup one-on-one. -on -one. Marsh defended it well. But you see early Steve Ford's going to allow DJ Burns to work one-on-one. -on -one. He's got a complement of centers. Hildreth all the way to the rim. That's why you want to save your best basketball, play the best basketball as here at the end of the game. Going up top, Matthew Marsh hammers it home. Passing around the perimeter against the zone. Hildred dropping it low to Marsh for the alley oop. Ten on the shot clock. Hildred weaving through, spins and scores. What a shot! I'm still trying to figure out how he contorted his body to get that shot off in slow motion. Jumps, does a 360, just completely throws Jesse Edwards off balance. Jesse Edwards looks back at his bench like, wait a minute, did that just happen? Long to push the tempo. Lammy running. Wilson got airborne, didn't know what to do with it. Here's Hildreth, he finds the lane, and he will slam it down. Here's Williamson, a star yesterday. Can't get a shot away. Hildreth off the fake, a three, hits it with 3.3 to go. And be sealed at the free throw line. If Miami, Miami's able to step up and knock down both of them, a four-point game can end it.